plunged deep in the middle of the Mediterranean Sea, Italy is one of the first names many people think of when they think about European travel destinations. Every year, Italy attracts over 64 million visitors with its coastal charm, dramatic landscapes, flavorful delicacies, and incredible range of art and architecture. But when it comes to touring this bootlegged country, you'll always find yourself short on time to visit all the diverse places the country has to offer. So, in this video, we're rounding off the top 11 places to visit in Italy. First, we're taking a gondola ride to number 11, Venice. Located in northeastern Italy, Venice is famous for its intricate network of canals, romantic gondolas, and stunning architecture. Built atop the turquoise Adriatic Sea on a range of 118 islands, Venice is a picturesque archipelago and floating city. The only way of connecting one island with the rest is through a network of charming bridges and meandering canals. When it comes to canals, the Grand Canal is the most popular canal that divides the city into two and breaks down into smaller canals as it flows. Despite being one of the most bustling parts of Italy, you should definitely spend some time here. Some of the most important landmarks of this floating city are St. Mark's Square, the Basilica, Doge's Palace and the iconic Rialto Bridge. By night, Venice's ambiance transforms into a romantic spectacle. Gliding along the Grand Canal at dusk offers a magical perspective of the city's architectural splendors, especially the Venetian palazzi that line its banks. Number 10. Naples Tucked in the shadow of the magnificent Mount Vesuvius in the Gulf of Naples, Naples is a vibrant Italian city. It is also the birthplace of pizza, with pizzerias like Da Michele and Sorbillo serving up classic Neapolitan pies and pizzas. With its strategic location, Naples puts you quite close to many stunning destinations in Italy, including the Amalfi Coast, Pompeii, and even the island of Capri. But we'll indulge more on these a bit later in the video. Naples Bay offers stunning views of the sea as the volcano creates a picturesque background to the urban city. Tourists can wind through the narrow alleyways and find their way into the historic city center, ornate churches, and bustling markets. When it comes to neighborhoods, Naples is a city of many aesthetics. The Bohemian Quartieri Spagnoli a maze of narrow streets contrasts with the elegance of Chiaia, known for its upscale boutiques and waterfront promenades. For a touch of Italian royalty, Naples Castel de Lovo, Royal Palace of Naples and the opulent Royal Chapel are some of the best gems to check out. Number 9. Amalfi Coast the Amalfi Coast in Italy is a breathtaking stretch of coastline that winds along the southern edge of the Sorrentine Peninsula. This UNESCO World Heritage Site is renowned for its dramatic natural landscape, where towering cliffs adorned with vibrant vegetation plunge into the cerulean waters of the Tyrrhenian Sea. The Amalfi Coast is home to 13 colorful seaside towns, multiple resorts, and Michelin-star restaurants, serving fresh seafood and Italian cuisine to travelers. Amalfi and Positano are some of the most popular towns with medieval architecture, pastel-hued houses, and panoramic views from atop. On the other hand, Atrani takes you to a humble fishing village with winding alleys. Braiano's secluded shorelines will appease beach lovers. And Minori, home to one of the oldest pastas in the world, is a mecca for foodies. The coast's natural beauty is best explored along the winding coastal road, where each twist and turn unveils stunning vistas. Hiking enthusiasts can travel through ancient footpaths, such as the famous Path of the Gods, that offer unparalleled views of the coastline and the azure waters below. The Amalfi Coast is also a culinary haven offering fresh seafood, sun-ripened citrus fruits, and locally produced limoncello liqueur. The 
The charming villages are dotted with traditional trattorias, inviting travelers to savor the region's flavors. Number 8. Sardinia Are you looking for a wild island getaway against green-blue waves and unparalleled beauty? It's time to find our way to Sardinia, Italy. Ranging from coastal splendors to rugged mountain ranges and lush forests, the island boasts over 1,100 miles of coastline with crystal clear waters and stunning beaches. Inland, you'll find the Genargento mountain range, which is home to Sardinia's highest peak, Punta La Marmora. The interior of the island also features rolling hills, cork oak forests, and picturesque valleys. Considered a world-famous coastline, Costa Smeralda is renowned for its luxurious resorts, glamorous nightlife, and some of the most stunning beaches in the Mediterranean. The island is also dotted with Murage, mysterious stone tower fortresses built by the Nuragic civilization around 1500 BC. Perhaps the most well-preserved of these complexes is the Sunuraxi di Barovini, a UNESCO World Heritage Site. From the Isola de la Zinara and Sant'Antioco Island to the archipelago of La Maddalena, you can easily expect to spend a few days exploring the infinite beauty and attractions of Sardinia. Number 7. Pompeii Referenced in many artistic pieces throughout the centuries, Pompeii is a former Roman city located in the southern end of Italy, only 15 miles away from Naples. The UNESCO World Heritage Site is the only one of its kind and was discovered in 1748. Once a bustling Roman city, it was tragically buried beneath layers of volcanic ash and pumice during the catastrophic eruption of Mount Vesuvius in 79 AD. Walking through its streets reveals remarkably preserved structures, including houses, shops, temples, and a grand amphitheater. Intricate frescoes, colorful mosaics, and detailed architectural elements can be seen throughout the city. Pompeii is also home to the Grand Amphitheater, the oldest surviving Roman amphitheater with tiered seating and a well-preserved area. In some parts of the city, you can also see casts of ancient Romans that were created by pouring plaster into the cavities of human remains. Regardless of whether you're a history buff or not, Pompeii is frozen in time and a marvel to walk through. Number 6. Lake Garda Nestled in the northern region, Lake Garda is a stunning body of water that stretches across approximately 370 square kilometers, offering a diverse landscape that encompasses rugged mountains, rolling hills, and charming lakeside villages. From the medieval allure of Sirmione, with its ancient Roman ruins and thermal baths, to the captivating elegance of Malcicine, crowned by a medieval castle, each town around the lake has its own unique character. Lake Garda is a haven for outdoor enthusiasts. Its brisk winds and crystal clear waters make it a paradise for windsurfing, sailing, and kite surfing. The surrounding hills and mountains invite hikers and cyclists to explore panoramic trails through vineyards, olive groves, and forests, while the cable car to Monte Baldo provides breathtaking vistas. Number 5. Sicily Sicily is the biggest island in the Mediterranean Sea, boasting a warm and sunny climate year-round because of its proximity to North Africa. Its natural beauty is a mosaic of contrasts, featuring rolling hills, verdant vineyards, dramatic coastlines, and the commanding presence of Mount Etna, one of Europe's most active volcanoes. The city is also dotted with ancient Greek and Roman ruins. The Valley of the Temples in Agrigento showcases the island's rich history, while Palermo features beautiful, bustling markets and cathedrals. Within Sicily, you should also visit the Aeolian Islands, a UNESCO World Heritage Site with crystalline waters and unique volcanic landscapes. 
Tourists can engage in water sports such as yachting, snorkeling, diving, and swimming, as well as kayaking. Or you can simply sunbathe on the golden beaches that stretch for miles. Because Sicily has been influenced by numerous cultures like Greek, Roman, Norman, and Arab, the city is a haven for foodies. Some of the classic dishes you must try in Sicily are pignolata, cazzilli, crispedi, and arancini. Number 4. Tuscany Known for the Leaning Tower of Pisa, Tuscany is a picturesque city in the center of Italy. This enchanting region is a canvas of vineyards, olive groves, and medieval towns that perfectly blend natural beauty with cultural heritage. In the heart of Tuscany lies Florence, the cradle of the Renaissance and a treasure trove of art and architecture. With its stunning dome designed by Brunelleschi, the Florence Cathedral and the Uffizi Gallery, which houses masterpieces by Botticelli, Michelangelo, and Leonardo da Vinci are must-visit attractions. Tuscany's allure extends beyond its well-trodden paths. The Maremma region offers pristine beaches along the Tyrrhenian Sea and the historic Etruscan ruins of Vetalonia. The thermal springs of Saturnia provide relaxation and rejuvenation, set against a backdrop of rolling hills. For outdoor enthusiasts, the Casentino Forests, Monte Amiata, and the Apuan Alps offer hiking, biking, and nature exploration. Number 3. Cinque Terre only two hours away from Florence, Cinque Terre is a mesmerizing tapestry of natural beauty and charming villages. Defined by rugged cliffs that cascade down to the Ligurian Sea, Cinque Terre forms a series of five picturesque fishing villages. Monterosso al Mare, Vernazza, Cornelia, Manarola, and Rio Maggiore. These villages are interconnected by scenic hiking trails and a charming coastal train line that stops even the most seasoned tourists dead in their tracks. The most famous trail is the Sentiero Azzurro, stretching for over seven miles and taking hikers through all five towns that make up Cinque Terre. On the other hand, the Via della Morre is a short and easy coastal path that connects Rio Maggiore and Manarola, winding along romantically. In fact, the name of the path translates to the love path. The terraced hillsides of Cinque Terre are home to ancient vineyards that produce unique wines, including the well-known Chacquetra dessert wine. Some wineries offer tours and tastings, providing insight into the winemaking process and the opportunity to sample local varietals. Cinque Terre is also popular for its delicious Ligurian cuisine. Be sure to try the locally made pesto, fresh seafood dishes, focaccia bread, and of course, the region's signature Chacquetra wine. Number 2. Capri Nestled in the azure waters of the Tyrrhenian Sea, Capri is a captivating island gem that boasts a harmonious blend of breathtaking natural beauty and historical allure. Its dramatic landscapes showcase rugged cliffs that plunge into the crystal clear waters, creating a mesmerizing display of colors and textures. The island's most iconic feature is the famed Faraglioni rock formations, towering limestone stacks that emerge majestically from the blue sea and feature sparse vegetation. At a height of over 100 meters, Faraglioni rocks feature small central cavities that little boats can easily pass through. Capri is also home to one of Italy's most fascinating natural wonders. The Blue Grotto is a 100-meter deep-sea cave renowned for its luminescent blue waters. Tourists can take a boat ride through the cave or dive right into the depths of the crystal clear waters. The island itself is dotted with charming villages and historical sites that make any trip worthwhile. The town of Capri exudes a Mediterranean charm, with its narrow streets and whitewashed buildings adorned with bougainvillea. With numerous beautiful stretches of beaches available throughout the island, you can always find a good spot to soak up the sun and enjoy local delicacies. But if you're looking for the best spot to see the entire island and beyond, head to Villa Jovis, an ancient palace that was once home to Emperor Tiberius. Number 1. Rome Nicknamed the Eternal City, Rome is the capital city of modern-day Italy. 
just like it was the capital of the Roman Empire. With a history spanning over two and a half thousand years, Rome is a living museum with a rich cultural heritage, architectural marvels, and a piazza culture unlike any other part of Italy. At its heart stands the Roman Forum and Colosseum, an iconic symbol of Rome's former glory as the epicenter of the Roman Empire. This ancient amphitheater once hosted gladiatorial contests and grand spectacles, but today stands as a testament to both human engineering and history. If you're keen on people watching in Italy, Rome's piazzas are some of the most vibrant and active social hubs. Piazza di Spagna's Spanish steps offer a perch for people watching, while the Trevi Fountain entices with its grandeur and the tradition of tossing a coin over one's shoulder for good luck. With its Baroque fountains, the vivacious Piazza Navona is home to the Campo di Fiori and is alive with artists, musicians, and locals enjoying the lively atmosphere. As the sun sets over the Tiber River, the city's nightlife comes alive, filling the streets with laughter and conversations. The charming Trastevere district captures the essence of Rome's community spirit, offering intimate cafes, narrow streets, and a vibrant art scene. Last but not least, the Vatican City is certainly one of the must-visit spots within Rome. Featuring architectural masterpieces like St. Peter's Basilica, the Sistine Chapel, and the Vatican Museums, the Vatican City is the smallest independent country in the world and has served as the center of Christianity since the 4th century. And this is the end of our video. If you liked traveling deep into Italy's treasure trove of destinations, make sure you leave a like and subscribe. That way, we'll book you a passenger seat on our upcoming video travels. In the meantime, check out this cool video right here.